वेलकम बैक वी आर हियर विद नाइन्थ ऑफ मास्क ऑली ब्लेसिंग आई एम श्योर योर होली मस्ट हैव गॉन वेरी वेल एंड यू वुड हैव अंडरस्टूड द मीनिंग ऑफ स्पिरिचुअल होली एंड टुडे वी गोन टू लर्न अबाउट हाउ डू वी बिकम अ कॉन्स्टेंट योगी समन हु इज ऑलवेज इन अ स्टेट ऑफ मेडिटेशन यू लास्क मे हाउ कैन इट बी पॉसिबल दैट यू आर वर्किंग एंड यू आर डूइंग योर डेली चोज एंड यू स्टिल मेडिटेटिंग वेल इट इज पॉसिबल इट्स ऑल अबाउट लव so today we are going to explore about love with the supreme creator the supreme light and let's see how does that make a difference in the life so godfather says may you be a constant yogi and loved by the father because of your speciality of being loving and detached now loving and detached how could these two things exist together god says how loved you are by the father see the whole world loves god or the creator father means father of knowledge how loved you are by the father can be seen by how detached you are from everything so if you are detached from your family members detached doesn't mean that you don't love them rather detached means that you don't expect anything in return from them no love no appreciation no attention or any other things like that and that's the only method that your mind and intellect can be free from asking from them and it's not just family members it's friends even the boss even subordinates even the people of the world in any different state or stage in their life so if you're detached from them and you're not thinking my children will grow when they grow they love me back see that's the stage they are in and that state they are in and then desiring that when they grow so from that stage to this stage so god says when you detach from these expectations only then can you have time and energy to love me or to receive my love if you are a little detached and otherwise caught up with many things yeah little detached i am yeah these things are not important that is not important but this is very important i have to do this thing you would then be just as loving the sign of those who are constantly loving to the father is their natural remembrance they don't have to be taught to remember god they are not so engaged in the worldly things that they have to be reminded no it's time to remember god or oh, the traffic control is going on now remember god or oh, you know this is a time for meditation something that is loved is naturally and constantly remembered so how many times and how many moments do you remember god every moment that's why it's mentioned swas or swas that means every breath so this is someone so this is someone loved every cycle every cycle god is loved how can i forget someone so lovely i forget the father when i consider someone now this is very important someone could be a relative could be child could be husband wife could be a friend or a relative so when i consider someone or something even lovelier than him that means it can be even food items yes some people have so much of desire of food items that they can be completely devoured in that food and forgotten where god is they just in the taste so god says that can be something right even lovelier than him if i constantly consider the father to be the loveliest i will become a constant yogi constant yogi that means someone who is in constant love with god and remembrance of god even while doing their normal chores is that possible yes very much possible i'm practicing that and trying to make it much better on a daily basis as much as possible and so can you but for that you'll have to learn the knowledge of who am i and who is he so that you the real you can connect to the real him otherwise in kali yuga it is very difficult to find the real knowledge of the self and of the creator so you're most welcome to learn the spirit of knowledge of brahma kumaris om shanti this